freshman high school player in the country. Teams, many of the people here are here to see him perform. And he has rarely let people down. 31 and 14 in the semifinal win, stretches the floor, can do it from just about anywhere, uses that length. Defenses that are always geared to try to stop him, few have been able to. At forward for the rail splitters, a six foot nine freshman, number 21, Imani Bates. And Ypsilanti Lincoln in the whites. And we're underway. I'm sure these young players, all of them, are dealing with that right now. Bates got it. Oh boy. Long defense by Lincoln. Caleb Hunter will go inside. That's blocked. Here comes Samadi Bates. That's the first on JT Morgan. Comerica Park on Sunday, April 28th. Register now. Donnelly's team with the ball. Here's Caleb Hunter. Daniel Friday. Just sort of forcing his way inside. Can't hit. And the presence of Amati Bates had a lot to do with that. Ypsilanti Lincoln has yet to score in the second quarter. Right now, Amari Fried is winning that matchup. But that'll get Bates back into it. Amati Bates oh, my is goodness. feeling it a little bit now. He gave you everything there, didn't he? You need to have the skills. You need to have the ball handling, the fundamentals, all of it. And Bates certainly does. Lead is six. Dozier. Can hit. Here comes Amadi Bates. He wants to run. Almost lost it, but lost it up a floater. Thinking out of halftime. Yeah, watch this thing. Had it on a string, string broke. <laughs> but he was able to keep it in gear. Bates with a block. Pitching defensively. JT Morgan can't get it to go. Bates will rebound. He wants to run. Over Thomas. Oh, back iron, no. Wow. Did you hear the noise yes. level of the building? The noise made it hard to hear the whistle in live action. Oh, and the foul just at the rack. Young fellow with a chance to tie this game up. I mean, they, whatever Jesse Davis said at halftime, and I think we got a little bit of it when he was talking with Brooke. Of a different swagger about him here in the, uh, in the third quarter. I'm sure Pat Donnelly on the other end probably telling his guys, okay, hey, Three fouls now on uh, Jalen Thomas. That's something to watch. He's a big presence inside for U of D Jesuit. Bates right to the lane. There you go. Once he turned the corner, there was no one there. Thomas is out defending on perimeter. He's the guy that rim protected. But he didn't get there in time, and by the time he got there, he was a spectator. Now it's good and good. Dozier inside, blocked by Amati Bates. Headman pass. Tired by Montgomery now. Now he's been handed off. Morgan has him. Second foul on JT Morgan. Shep and Gibby and Dan Petrie as the Tigers and Braves battle it out. In Tiger Town, that's tomorrow afternoon. It's definitely a solid enough shooter to be a double figure scorer. Bates got it. Why is that not being exploited a little closer to the basket? Right. Got it. Throw it away. Here's a money. Bates wants the ball with Montgomery guarding. Pull back. Got it. Uh, oh my goodness. Bates, but there are others too. It is Bates. 
You gotta go. Guarded by Frank. You gotta go. Really gotta go. Frank. Off the iron note. Put back. Yes! Yes! And Vladdy Lincoln at the buzzer.